From a young age, Natasha Brow has been able to express her creativity through multiple forms of art, starting with dance. I've been dancing since I was three, and I stopped dancing when I went away to college. Well, we well, never really stopped dancing. Mm -hmm. So I competed heavily for about 15 years, and then I got to college, and it was just an extracurricular fun hobby. Doing everything from ballet to tap to hip hop to contemporary to modern, her diverse dance styles opened up a lot of opportunities, including traveling for a dance convention by the name LADM. I was on the company that traveled with the faculty, and I was a, then I became a dance assistant for the faculty. So I went to every single city. There were about 13 cities. And I got to be a role model for young dancers who... I was once in their position, and I loved the convention. I used to go to that convention as a, as a studio dancer, and then I became an assistant for the convention, so I got to become the role model that I used to have as a child. Today, Natasha is a fourth-year student at Syracuse University, continuing to evolve her creative side, majoring in communications design and minoring in business startups. To Syracuse and saw the building and what the kids were making and the outcome of my major, that's why I chose it. So I've been very lucky to have gotten a lot out of my major and I definitely think I'm in the place I was supposed to be. With a year left before graduation, Natasha is already taking the steps to help her in her future career in entrepreneurship. Well, I have my own business idea and I'm basically going through the motions to start up a venture. I've been doing business pitch competition, and that will hopefully lead me to being able to break into the entrepreneurship field. Tap into your creative side and see the opportunities that come your way. For Canyons News, I'm Megan McClister.